The Prima Board of Directors presents the Distinguished Service Award to individuals based on outstanding contributions to public sector risk management and their sustained involvement and leadership in our profession. The special honor is not an annual award, rather it's presented only when merited. And I will have to say that this man travels all over the country representing Prima in everything that he does and he has such a special place in my heart for his tenacity in, in public risk management. I am so pleased and so proud to recognize Michael G. Fan, Director of Loss Control, Tennessee Municipal League Risk Management Pool. Michael, please come forward. Uh, thank you all so very much. Uh, I ask that you bear with me. Uh, I tend to be a very emotional sort. I've been known to tear up faster than Speaker John Boehner peeling an onion. <laughs> but, um, I try to do my best, but uh, I'm deeply honored by uh, receiving this recognition uh, from, from truly my, my, my risk management family. Um, thank you, Prima Board, and, and all of the Prima membership for this, for this recognition. So I take the time and effort to get involved in Prima and invest yourself in, public, in the public risk discipline. First, because it is said that to whom much is given, much will be required. Uh, when you have received as much as I have due to my association with the people in this room and the many that came before us, I couldn't help but want to invest myself into the lives of those who desire better risk management and more effective public administration. Secondly, my parents uh, instilled in me the belief that the person who invests him or herself in the lives of others will truly never be poor. To this day, I continue to reap a return on the investment I try to sow in the lives of my fellow public risk managers. At significant risk of leaving dozens of people out who have assisted and helped and just uh, mentored me through the years, please allow me to thank a few folks. My dad and mom for setting an amazing example for me and doing the right things the right way for the right reasons. To my wife Terry for understanding that my calling was on the road, building relationships and helping people. Jack Floyd and Jim Richardson, who hired a kid fresh out of graduate school and gave him a chance to make a real difference in improving local government in Tennessee. I want to thank my loss control teammates at the TML pool, especially a young lady that I've called co-worker, teammate, and friend for more than 28 years, Judy Hauser, who is very likely the best and most effective local government loss control consultant in the country. Amen. Paul Chambliss, my co-worker and friend, whose dedication, understanding, and sense of humor have inspired me for more than 20 years. And George Dalton, otherwise known as the Risk Evangelist, <laughs> my assistant director of loss control, and dear friend and confidant for the last 16 years, who truly deserves more than, more than half of this award. Paul, Bill, Chester, Andy, Tasha, and maybe most of Maybe, <clears throat> maybe most importantly, Lottie. I want to thank the members of the Tennessee chapter, especially those that are here, still fighting the good fight of public risk management. I'm so proud to call you guys friends, and you inspire me every day. Let me thank a few role models and co-laborers uh, for public entity loss control, great folks. Uh, that include people like Les Horn and Greg Langan and Rich Vincelette, Dennis Molnar, and many others who have influenced me through the years. I want to thank my risk management mentors and friends who invested themselves in Prima and the public risk discipline by teaching and writing and who took my calls and my stupid questions in those early days. People like Abby Hudgens and Al Hyman and George Head and Mark Ferraro, Bob Bieber, Dave Randall, a couple of these are still around, Dave Randall, Kathy Howe, Corey Stein, Ray Sibley, Tom Vance, and other giants of our profession upon whose shoulders that we stand. And finally, let me thank a few people that showed me that it wasn't always about what was in the textbook, but that public risk management was more about the relationships, the friendships, because we served together and learned together, and sometimes even cried and bled together. We developed bonds that surpassed our chosen profession. 
People like Tracy Dahl Webb and Jim Hurt, Dan Pliska, Terry Evans, Bill Stoll, Jamie Tyler, Belvin Hale, Dorothy, Brandon, Rich, Carlene, Mulva and Dolores, <laughs> <laughs> Laura and Janie. Let me conclude by thanking the good Lord specifically for two things. For guiding me to a group of professionals called Premier. During the time, about 10 years ago, when a few of our longtime friends and Prima supporters began to get discouraged and leave the association for various reasons, I was asked frequently why I was still here. I answered simply, because Prima is my professional association. Translated that was Prima is my profession. <laughs> <laughs> and secondly, I thank the good Lord for guiding me to a profession that is worthy in serving my fellow man and therefore worthwhile for me physically and mentally, and as such, worth doing right. So as you contemplate these next two or three evenings here at this conference, I'll fin finish by paraphrasing the great 20th century philosopher, George Clinton. <laughs> and his words later immortalized by the 21st century philosopher Coolio. <laughs> Ain't no party like a Long Beach party, because a Long Beach party don't stop. May God bless all of you.